All right, Monk City Angles, guys. I am with you guys again today. Uh, and this is what we're going to be doing today. Today is going to be a little bit different. Today is going to be just a conversation that I, I, I want to have with you guys um, in reference to making a difference. Uh, I think it's important that uh, in everything you do in life, man, it should be uh, influential um, in one way or another. Um, a lot of times we find ourselves in very selfish situations where uh, we don't get a chance or the privilege to do something that will make a difference in the person next to you like um, and, I, and I think that is something significant uh, One of the things that I've always been able to contribute my life to uh, is, is being able to influence or help somebody that's next to me um, Somebody did it for me. Um, I had people that poured into my life in, 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 a, in a lot of different ways uh, but in positive ways uh, it's a difference between um, doing things that's necessarily uh, isn't positive or isn't something that 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 gravitate or takes you to or leads you to success. Uh, it's important, man, that you uh, allow yourself to identify what's important and what's not important and how it relates to your your life as an individual. Uh, one thing I've been able to contribute my life to. Uh, it's just always being a positive influence to somebody. Uh, and I think that's a cool thing, man. Whether it be me giving a compliment or, you know, whether it be me taking time out of my busy schedule to uh, share my thoughts and feelings and, and coaching or whatever it is for someone else. Uh, for me, it's always been about football. Uh, for me, football has, you know, allowed me to take time out and develop a kid next to me or, or a child next to me. Um, working in juvenile counseling, for example, it, it, it gave me the opportunity to do the exact same thing. Um, even in my job as, as a marketing director, um, I've had the privilege to uh, not just be a great salesman, but be a guy that, you know, had values and poured those values into other people. Um, and I think that's a cool thing, man. One thing fishing um, has been able to give, has been able to provide for me is just being understanding uh that every day is different. Anytime you're on a lake, you're on a different body of water. Uh, the fish could be biting one day, they could be not biting the next day. Uh, and then you have to make adjustments, man. And to make an adjustment is the same thing with life. Sometimes you put, you find yourself in situations where in a split of a second, you have to make an adjustment. And sometimes we don't have the right guidance or the right support in order to make those adjustments. And I think those adjustments are key. Anytime you're trying to take yourself to success, they say in order for you to go someplace you've never been, you have to do something you've absolutely never done before. So you can go back and ask any successful person. Those people have done things that, you know, maybe their family member has never done. Maybe their mom or their dad has never done it before. And, you know, it becomes very, very unique to you. Uh, and I think that's cool, man, because I think that's that's the way that you find your inner self. That's where you find your most success. It's just to do something you've absolutely never done before. Uh, for me, I fished my whole entire life from the bank. Uh, never thought of, th thought of tournament fishing. Nobody in my family ever tournament fished or, you know, nobody ever thought about doing it at that scale. Uh, I have a lot of professional athletes that have gone on before my family, uh, whether it pertains to football or basketball or even baseball for that matter. Uh, but nobody never jumped into uh, the fishing market and, and wanted to create something that, you know, this community from the Glaze area uh, has never seen. Uh, so I thought it would be something unique, man. My junior angler program is going to be unique. Uh, it's going to be different, going to be something that the city has never seen before, uh, which I think is extremely cool because it's going to allow some of these kids to focus on things that they've never focused on before. Uh, it's going to give them time to understand that patience is important, uh, change up is important, uh, being able to identify and study uh, things that, you know, things that is going to make you successful in the long run. One thing I talked about uh, a couple weeks ago on my Instagram was, you know, being able to, you know, do something different, but be okay with learning something new, okay? Um, for me, the reason why I'm able to catch fish at the magnitude that I'm able to catch fish in that now is that I study it. You know, I find myself on YouTube for countless hours at times, just learning new things, learning new techniques, learning new styles, uh, learning new baits, uh, whatever the case may be, guys. You guys have to put yourself in position uh, to learn new things, man. I think that's key for anybody 
and, and trying to create something or value something. Dreams are made uh, based on a vision. Uh, first off, you get the vision. It takes effort and hard work to make that vision becomes a reality, become a reality. And I think that's important, man. Everybody in the world has something unique about them. Um, and everybody has a vision. Everybody has a purpose. Uh, but it's going to take hard work. It's going to take effort. It's, it's, it's going to take, you know, you to go someplace you've absolutely never gone before in order for you to get that off the ground, whatever that may be. Um, and I think that's cool, man. Just, just my message tonight, man, is just to allow you guys to understand that don't be driven by fear. Do not be driven by fear. Find something unique about your life that you enjoy and find a way to help somebody else. That's my message for tonight. But guys, remember, Monk City Angle on Instagram, Monk City Angle on Facebook, uh, builttolast21.com is the website. Guys, please, if you have any questions, uh, concerns, or anything like that, shoot me a message. I'd be glad to answer any questions that you guys may have, whether it pertains to life uh, or anything, guys, or, or it pertains to fishing. If you got any questions, man, definitely hit me up. You can find me again on Instagram, Facebook, uh, and YouTube, guys. Again, it's all Monk City Angler. Uh, BuiltToLast21.com is the website. Jump on the website. Read about the program. Get an idea on what we're doing and the success that we're trying to have with the program and the upcoming Junior Angler program, man. It's going to be dope for the city. Uh, I look forward to seeing a lot of you guys. Look forward to having fun. Looking forward to fishing with a lot of you guys. In the meantime, though, let's continue to set hooks and let's find success.